Hi, it's Rest from Protos Expert, and I'm here with a copy of Wave Alchemy's Pro 2, which is based upon the Sequential Circuits Pro 1. A great synth in its day, used on endless tracks, uh, too numerous to mention, but if you want to give a shout out to any after you've watched this review, then pop them on the comments section. But a, a great synth, and this is 6,500 samples. Uh, it's several gigs worth of stuff. And it comes in a really kind of unique way. You have a kind of preset section, then you have the raw section, which you can mix the two together. Then you have a step sequencer and effects and some controls at the end as well. So let me just give you some stuff to, to have a look at straight away. So as I say, you have the basic uh, instruments that you can go right back into if you want to and use those or you have the presets you can start with this is like kind of a core layer you can start with and play a few of them for you now so you can have a nice bass like that then you can come to the synth section here and choose a waveform like i could choose like a pwm and bring a second one in do some fine tuning on those two a sub in as well if I want. Let's put a square sub in. And of course we can start modding that as well. Put an envelope on it. And we can mix those two. Says the master, we can mix this back in. Put the master down a bit again. Before we get too much clipping. We've then got a full effect section, so it's phaser. The full controls. Distortion. See, straight away you get some real filthy sounds. A nice reverb. Bit crusher. Nice flanger. And see the sound uh, alteration is quite extreme in some ways and a delay of course as well which is great for leads so so you can start with that base level preset what we call they're, they're calling it the preset section or you can start with the raw section it's entirely up to you however comfortable you feel with programming a synth so there's not only this really huge library of these kind of presets you can work with uh, but also as I say there's these cool presets as well so we could bring this one in instead four pole lead or something like that as you can hear, they're quite extreme, some of them. Nice and retro. And having a sound like that is a perfect time to show you the sequencer. So here's the sequencer. It's triggered by C8 and turned off by uh, B7. And the sequence is quite cool because uh, let me just turn that down a bit while I show it you. You can trigger three things. You can trigger the res. So we put the filter on. And the cutoff. I just use it in a note mode instead. And it's just a case of then just building up a sequence in step time. And making it as long as you like. That's four at the moment. Let's make it to eight. Thank you. 
And of course, notes on and off, so you can get gaps in there as well. Then you can save them, write them to memory, and bring them back as well. You can shuffle them. And just randomize it, see what you get. Of course, change the rate. Sync it to your sequencer. You get the idea anyway. But of course, if you wish, you can just play it uh, as a regular synth or play sequences actually from your, your DAW instead. But to give you some more sounds, just to give you an idea. So we've got... This is a polyphonic sound, so we can, they've got some monophonics and some polyphonics. Very nice. So we can go and filter that then. Resonance there is really cracking it up, it's great. So, some beautiful big pads, some nice wobbly subs. Great for. Cool bass. Of course, we can also uh, use modern stuff as well. And we've got that wobble in there as well. Really nice. Then they have multis as well. So if we close that off and go and open up a multi, let's bring one of those in. Watch we bring in distant landscape empathy. How's that going to? work. Let's have a look at that. So there we've got two in there now. Stacked. So very, very nice, big sounds. So I say six and a half thousand presets. We don't have time to go through all of them now. Over three and a half gigs worth of samples. You need contact player to use it. You can't use the free player. And then... Uh, Here's the news though, and this is why I love small software companies, £39, which is fantastic value. When you think of some of the things I often review on here, which have far less uh, sound on them, they have uh, far less features on them, and these uh, guys over at Wave Alchemy have put this together for £39, that's a steal, that's an absolute bargain. And for that reason, yep, you guessed it, it's going to get editor's choice. Well, what else could I do? It's uh, such a ridiculously low price for such a fantastic instrument. Of course, the only downside is you're going to need to have content to play, although they do have it in other formats. They have it in Reason format. They have it in EXS24 format. So check out their store. But as I say, fantastic value, fantastic synth. It's taken me some time to get to it, but I'm glad I did because this is a great thumbs up. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon.